Hey guys, and welcome back to more The Suffering. When we last left off, we defeated Killjoy. And, oh, that reminds me. We have a archive of Killjoy. Somewhere. Didn't we? What? Where was that then? Ah, there we go. Dr. Killjoy. One of Abbott's most persistent legends tells of Dr. Killjoy, a quite insane psychiatrist surgeon who ran an asylum on Carnate. Doing research of my own, I found that he did indeed exist, though which stories are true and which are fabrication is anyone's guess. Since the cataclysm, I have three times seen a surgeon formed of pure light, reminiscent of 16 millimeter film projection come to life. Could this the fine doctor? Apparently so. Well, I don't think he'll be bothering us anymore. Well, I don't actually know if we killed him. I think we probably um, at least upset him a little bit. So, let's see if we can't replenish some of our supplies a little bit. We really need um, flashlight batteries. Like, that's priority one. If we can find some. Oh, I'm sure there are going to be some around here. Interesting that, like, the one level where we really sort of possibly might have needed them. And we didn't get any. Ah. Nope. They are not what we're looking for. We also need pills. Lots and lots of pills. But I'm pretty sure that's something that's going to take care of itself in due time as well. Now, what else can we find around here? I wonder if, if we should try playing it in third person for a spell. Let's see how that works out for us. Kind of like the first person shooting, to be honest. There's a, the, the Tommy gun ammo is really weird, because... Like, it seems to be the weakest gun that we have. Never find us here. Well, maybe we won't. But we're going to try. Yeah, it's a bizarre weapon. You'll never find us in here. Yeah, pretty sure you just said that a minute ago. Ooh. Do you want to lead us torch? Uh, I mean, honestly, not really. But, uh, oh, hello. Ah, you son of a... Bitch. Ah, oh, you bloody burrowers. Come to Papa Talk. At least, to be fair, in third person mode, you get a much wider viewing angle. So, there's that. Right, you're done. Ooh. Ooh, that hurt. Hurt like a son of a bitch. Well, I didn't really. Come on. Come on. Let's be seeing you. Got ya. Def I was going to say, there's definitely still one more. Definitely still one more. Come on. Don't play with your boy. Sweet. Okay. So, I'm guessing that's everything in the... Oh, wait. And say I, I thought that was going to be everything. Yeah, when they do that quick swipe, they're really hard. Unless you're already like aiming directly at them, you're probably not going to hit much. Oh, me. Ooh, how mysterious. Urgent note. Oh, let's have a little look at our photo. Oh, the photo looks good. Apparently, if it starts getting dirty and smudged, that's when you need to panic a little bit. The prison is where you feel at home, talk. But which prison? Abbott or the prison you've made for yourself? Return to Abbott first. 
where shall I where I shall present you with my findings and we shall see go time is our enemy killjoy uh, it's all right Whoa, what the hell we got like rats now I guess I don't know what they are. Sounds like there's some uh, child's laughter. Cuts th right through me, that does. Ooh. Some seriously bad voodoo here. I offered them a bright new world. The pity so few of my patients lived to see it. Yeah, well, maybe you weren't the doctor you thought you were. What is that? Huh. Like a giant beast thing that's been splayed open and then um, set on fire. I can appreciate. Oh, let's keep going. Ooh. Now, if we can find some batteries. I would be a happy man. Sergey Stash. <laughs> Sergey Stash. I uh, wonder what ever happened to that Sergey. Sergey, I should say. Bless him. An interesting taste in art. Ooh, man. I mean, he really did like a little bit of everything, didn't he? Well, you know. Everybody's got their vices. And we're on fire. Which is not really what we want. Who's saying such things? Who's burning who now? Because I'd really appreciate if you didn't exactly burn me before I get a chance to get out of here. Man, here we go. Here we go. This is getting... Oh, no, 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 no. Is everything being resurrected or just some things? Uh, it looks like ev oh no 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 we're kind of getting stuck. Ow! Did you get resurrected? Or was it just those other guys? I'm not sure. Unless they only get resurrected X amount of times. I can see that. Whoa. Whoa. Again, I don't know whether he's new. Ow. Careful. Careful. Come on, talk. Duck and weave. Duck and weave. Alright, well. Let's see if we can't get up here. And try and find whoever the hell... Is helping us? So, oh, Molotov cocktails. Very nice. And a page. Sketchbook page. These infernal bladed monstrosities were bad enough before. Now they seem to be resurrecting. The secret appears to ah uh, to be to take their heads off with whatever means available. That will keep a slayer down for good. Only the same uh, simple trick worked on those confounded festers. Festers. Oh. I'm not exactly sure what a fester is. Unless it's those big fellas. But we haven't encountered those yet. Yeah. It's probably going to be easier to take the heads off in first person. Definitely easier to take the heads off in first person. Alright, so... I wonder if this is going to be a thing for the rest of the game now. Because that's going to seriously dial up the uh, fuck factor. 
quite significantly. Okay. Oh, hello. Now, blowing their heads off is fairly trivial. Yeah, I guess we can. Alright. Oh! <laughs> I like how weirdly, like, interactive some of the stuff in this game is. I mean, that... that helped. Some... Aquatic atrocities? We have aquatic atrocities. Dancing at the dawn of the apocalypse. Like it. Now that was cool. Oh, hello. Careful now. Sneak, sneak. Yeah, I gathered. It's good to see another human still among the living. The name is Clem, sir. I've been plotting my escape from Abbott for years, and I had hoped to carry out my exodus tomorrow. But these recent events have ruined everything. Here, I'll show you. Make him bleed? But why? He's not being nasty to me. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go. I have no intention of killing this dude. Ah, they're the aquatic things that he's going on about, I guess. The mainliners. Ooh, that was cool. Oh, were they? Oh. <laughs> I mean, coming out of the waves. Yep. I swear it is ever laid eyes upon. You reckon? Oh, bulletproof, apparently. Oh, oh, I see. Yeah, that wasn't very good, was it? You literally set yourself on fire. Um, this is questionable. So setting them on fire, is that the rub? Okay, okay, okay. This is, this is not good. Oh man, they're tough. They are tough. Finally, a worthy challenge. Excellent. Come on. Let's see those insides of yours. Come on, baby. Don't be coy now. There we go. Well, that was fucking useless on my part, wasn't it? Yeah, they hurt. They really hurt. Oh boy. Don't want to be down here, do we? Where's my friend? Ah, I'm guessing that's him dead. That's not good. Maybe it is good. Maybe it's good for him. These guys. Oh, man. You can't even hit their heads, can you? Um. Right, maybe. It's explosives? Do they... No, they don't seem to do... Oh, right, okay. Throwables, I guess. Gotta use those throwables. 
Good thing they're everywhere. It looks like our friend bought the farm as well. <clears throat> Come on, sir. That one was just for you. Fester. We're not talking about uncle either. Good lord. He's got some more batteries. It's always nice. Yeah, we're going to have to be very careful with our throwables then. Molotovs? Yeah, give me some TNT. Alright. I do like those festers. Come on. Thank you. Oof. Alright, let's have a little listen to these festers. I mean, there's still a lot of pages left. Fester. Continually emerging from the slave ship. These are the festering creatures who foil my attempts to escape this confounded rock. Rats live within their flesh, writhing within it and then springing forth randomly. They appear to be a reincarnation, not of the slaves, for then they would be of darker skin tone, but instead of the slave traders. In this form, they are forced to live out again and again the fate they forced upon those hapless slaves. Hmm. Guess they got eaten by rats. Board the slave ships. Pretty, pretty grim when you think about it. Right, looks like we've got some more. Alright. Come on, let's get this done. Ooh. Hopefully. Yeah, they're gonna beeline towards me, aren't they? Shotgun is definitely the ticket for those things. Oh god. Come on. Ooh, jeez. That's kind of cool. We're going to go through our explosives horrendously quick on these things. One down. Alright, let's try and take one out. Alright. Ooh. Maybe. Just maybe. Those Molotovs are where it's at. Jesus, there's more. There's always more. Come on, you. Let's see ya. Right, you know what? Let's try and sort you out first. Alright, so one Molotov sorts them out. Good to know. He's done. Get out of here. Yeah, they're pretty... Pretty menacing, actually. I mean, they're not strong once you know... Well, they are strong. But once you know their little secret... Not too bad. You like where these powder kegs go up. Should probably be conserving our ammo. At least as much... As is possible. Flares. Ah. I wonder if you... Flares. Warning. Booby trapped. Property of Clem. Keep off. Booby trapped. I wonder how that's booby trapped. Property of the State of Maryland. Department of Corrections. We're the docks. No. But we're close. How is this? I, I guess we ain't using that. I mean, there's definitely some humour tucked into this game as well, which I appreciate. If we let them uh, uh, is that our friend? I thought he died. So, I guess we've got to hunt all these things down. That's. Stuck, but we can't do nothing about it. Ooh, this is going to get really dark. Consuela. 
slave shipwreck. On the northwestern beach of the island is a massive shipwreck from the early 18th century. The ship carried a cargo of slaves and was en route to Norfolk when it was knocked off course and crashed. Apparently, the traders feared releasing the slaves they carried and instead left them trapped in the hull where they were slowly eaten by rats. How the ship has survived the elements nearly three centuries is certainly a mystery. It is a ghost ship. Yep, pretty, pretty gribbly. Oof. All right. Kind of hard to tell. Oh. Charming. Charming, I'm sure. It's certainly loading us up. Um, yeah, we're going to be fighting a lot of these festers, aren't we? Luckily, with Molotovs, they really are quite trivial. And, by using the Molotovs, the rats appear to burn up in them. So that is certainly the rub. Okay. Not going that way. Yep, yeah, there's a lot of these Molotovs. Is that everything? Surely there's got to be more here. Aha! Can we open this? Kinda looks like we can. No. So is this ship just a bit of flavour? Just a little bit of a flavour text? Kinda looks that way. There's more Molotovs on here than you're ever gonna need. Right, looks like we need to maybe get up there. Oh shit. Possibly. I mean, that definitely would be my guess. Let's try that again, shall we? A little bit less failure. Every time I see a rat now, I just want to like blow its head off. Little rat brain spread all over the place. Ooh, can we get up here? We can. Ah. Guess we can't do anything with the wheel. Yeah, for a three century old ship, it looks pretty good. Also, how's there literally Molotovs all over this thing? I mean, I know we're playing a bloody video game, but jeez. So, ooh, there we go. This looks, oh, I was going to say, this looks like it. Suffocating. Uh-oh. <laughs> this place wants you, Tork. It needs people like you. Once it gets a hold of you, it won't let you go. Like it hasn't let me go. I've been here a damn long time, and it's sucked me dry. I pray it's almost done with me. It's sending something after you. It let you out for a bit. Now it wants you back, deep inside. Deep inside where I've been all these fucking years. Don't say I never did anything for you. So he's like helping us, I guess. Randomly enough. Oh. Oh, explosive rats. Alright, let's hope we're going the right way. Oh boy. Yep. Well, 
thanks to our friend there. I guess we're not going to get eaten or exploded by rats today. At least, not too much. Just a little bit. Kind of an interesting, like, water texture effect going on here. Oh, hello. Man, certainly going to be addicted to this Zombra. Oh, Zombrex stuff by the time we get out of here. One for you. Yeah, Mum. There you go. Oh. That's not how that's supposed to happen. Curious. Lots of batteries. Alright. Much better. We're in a much better place now. Oh, hello. Yep, none of your nonsense. Oh, one for you. Um, rats. No, 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 no. I'm sure how these rats aren't burning up anymore. But, whatever, I guess. Ooh. God damn it. I like the way the texture changes. Like, whatever these burrowers are under, the texture changes. So it's actually quite a cool little detail. And I have definitely missed this shotgun. Although it's not the best thing to use against these guys. Yep, get fucked. There you go. Ooh, lots of goodies. Keep you on your toes, son. Yeah, man. There we go. Any more for any more? Probably don't want to smash that or shoot that. Nice to come through the armory, though. Wow. Like, they just give you so much stuff that there's no way you can pick it all up. But I suppose it's better to have too much than not enough. We really literally are coming through an armory. Ooh. They make a really weird sound when they come out. Like that wet, kind of sloppy, squidgy sound. I actually don't mind it. Kind of tickles me in the right places. Hello. Take some of that. And some of that. Any more? Yeah, you want some more. Ooh. Had to be done. Yeah, it takes the lights out as well, which is interesting. Shit. Come on, get fucked. You scream at me. Oh no, rat shotgun shells. Ah. Uh, almost out of a lot of weapons, actually. Funny enough. That's not great. You know what? Switch up to this. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, so it's just wiggle the analog stick. I think. Wiggle the analog stick to freedom. Hello. It's interesting that... The music stops before every enemy is dead. Alright, so we've got a wheel. Which probably does something. Whether it does something good or not is another. Thanks for the can you threw away. <laughs> Alright. Unfortunately, we are almost out of time, and that means that we're almost out of time for my recording session for the week, which, uh, you know, not often I, you know, play a game that I really get into like this. kind of just want to... Oh, right. 
kind of just want to continue playing it. You know, this probably would have been a lot easier. Um, oh. If we had some lights over there. That's better. That's more like it. I don't know how long these last. Alright, that'll work. I think, anyway. Maybe that won't work. That'll work. Hey, there we go. Easy as that. Wow. He's watching you. Yeah? Oh! Hello. Was sly. Try that again. Sack of shit. That's what you get. Any more up there? Nope, just the one. Ooh, ooh. Can move those boxes. It's interesting. Very interesting. Guess we okay. They just disappear. That that's fine. We don't mind that. Again, not the most efficient way to get through. I'm sure. But it works. Hello. Oh, hey, friend. What you doing in there? Can't let him out by the sounds of things. Looks like they're just making sweet music in there. Which is random. What does this button do? I have absolutely no idea what this button does. Would be the answer to that. Definitely don't like being caught in the middle of that. You can have one. Come on. Burn to death. And you. Oh, jeez. Forgot about these. Yeah, we've got to shoot them in the head, haven't we? Um. Alright, well, I mean, we shot him in the head and then he ran off to die. Alright, cool. I guess. We've got options. I guess. Or, you know, maybe... Oh, wait, hang on. Ah, I thought that room looked a little bit familiar, but I'm not sure it does. Because we've kind of already been through here before. We have been through here before. Ah. Would you look at that? We've kind of gone full circle. Back into Carne. That's interesting. So, that's fine. But where are we going? So we've got a box. Ah, I wonder. I wonder. Let's see if we can shove this and get up there. A bit of a long shot, but you never know. Come on, stop, release it. 
how do we... Not the easiest thing to stop him from... We can come up here. Ah. Alright. Gonzo? What the hell is a Gonzo gun? Eh? What the fuck is that? Is that like a proper secret? <laughs> I mean, alright, I guess we've got some sort of thing that fires chickens. Chicken eggs. Sure. Right, let's drag. Alright, whatever. Let's drag this back. Gonzo gun. I wonder if it actually does power. Like, it actually does damage. And also, where do we get more ammo for it? So we still can't go through there yet. Uh, okay. It's almost like the all the same, like, Pills and things that we left behind are still here too. Which is really curious. But unfortunately, we are. Uh, all these dead guys that we've killed are still here as well. That's interesting. I, I'm wondering if that's just uh, on the Xbox and PC version. Ooh. Okay, so we lit the lights up. And this is, of course, where we first. Ah! All right. I've been waiting so long just to fucking sleep. I think you're my last chance, talk. Don't let me down. Well, we're gonna try to help you out, buddy. I'm certainly not gonna promise anything brother but I'm walking around with a chicken an awfully bad looking chicken at that I mean I really don't know what to make of this gonzo gun the freaking chicken egg launcher but anyway, guys, we are definitely going to have to save it because we really are out of time. Um, oh, I kind of don't want to stop playing. But unfortunately, them's the breaks. When will I next be able to? Yeah, it'll be about another week now so I can play some more. But, well, we might maybe fit a session in at some point. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.